guys it is 6 20 in the morning <laughs> we got up oh i got up at 5 45 and brandon got up earlier than i did um we're heading to the um community festival that um the city that the church is in is having today so i have i have brandon here he's not feeling good still and then Abby's in the back, but y'all can't see her because she's laying down. So we're heading over there now. We just left the church. We're heading to go set up. We're supposed to be setting up before 8.30, it's 7.34. So we got plenty of time. Um, I know hubby's not feeling the greatest, but he does look better than what he did when he woke up. But Renee and I will be doing most of the setting up. He's just gonna help us get the heavy, heavier things out. Um, Abby's still asleep. Abby's right there. She's very tired. So, anyways, we're heading that way now. And then we're starving. We need coffee. We need food. All that good stuff that we love. <laughs> Alright, guys. Yeah, we're praying that we can reach people. More than anything we can be a testimony to them uh, we will be passing um, candy out and then um, and flyers and of course last last year when we did this it was actually a great outcome so we're praying it it will be the same this year hello we're at the fall festival now um and uh uh mom's friend from church a member from church and dad and mom are setting up the tent right now um so let me show you this is how it looks like now they've just put it up what are you doing youtube channel <laughs> yes all right i'm gonna show you guys whenever we fall set it up. All right, here we are at the fall at Head Festival. Here's our church. Passing out flyers, passing out candy. Here's husband. How are you feeling? I'm all right. Feeling better? It's cold, isn't it? You didn't put your jacket on. There's uh, Reed and Abby. Abby! I'm having a great time. It's a little bit chilly out here, but we're having a good day so far. <laughs> Did you video me working hard? No. Thank you. Thank you. The ladies. <laughs> Some community outrage.
mini donuts. Are they good? The cinnamon. Are they good? They're homemade. I'm happy. <laughs> did not pick up the camera all day today it's already the next day um, we went to church we came home we ate I rested some Brandon rested some and now we're getting ready for this coming week um, I work I'm gonna be working at Michael's um, I say uh, Tuesday so I have to make my meal preparations for that day for this week coming week to figure out what we're going to be eating and then um that's my girl <laughs> brandon left to pick up asher um he got here late at 12 midnight last uh, yesterday well early this morning so um we had a great outcome in our um community outreach yesterday okay Ooh, i'm gonna sit down um like i was saying we had a a great um outcome we passed out about um over about close to 300 uh flyers um some people were not very like they didn't want to take the flyers <laughs> which we understand you know we get it but some were really Excuse me. Very nice and and you know took the flyers and asked us where we were located. We told them they're like, oh yeah, you see that little church, you know. So we had a great time yesterday. We were so tired. Like after we got home, we were exhausted, um, and then um, we literally just laid on the couch when we got home, and. Um, but after this um, festival that we were doing community outreach, uh, we have our fall, the church fall festival, which is October the 29th. And it's from two out of four. Um, and anyways, we have, I have to plan all that. We have to, we have people um, sitting their booth and all that and working on them and I am too, so. We're excited to see um, how many people we can reach. This is, like I said, it's more than anything to reach out to the community and to do community outreach. The um, We're gonna have a lot of different stuff like games and cakewalk and what else did we say? Um, we're trying to see if we can get like a, uh, like a jumpy house and then um, the fire department is gonna be there and then um, Someone asked us today, uh, not today, but yesterday, if they, if they would advertise our fall festival, if they could come set a booth for them, which is the Allstate Insurance, and we said, yes, sure, come on. You know, it's, um, it's just a way for, you know, for the community to just come together and help each other. So that's what we're doing in the next couple of days. We're gonna, I'm going to be working on working things for the fall festival. I have some ideas that I wanna um, do. Um, so we're excited to see where it goes. Um, okay, so here's an update on the church. Um, I don't think I have showed you guys the entire, how everything is looking, but I don't wanna give you guys an update until, or show you guys the updates until we have the carpet. This, the carpet is taking longer than we thought because they're asking questions that to me personally doesn't make sense, but it's all because I guess insurance purposes and all that. So it's taking longer than what we thought. And you know, we, we should have been in the sanctuary by now, but it's not working how we want it to be working and God knows why. So we, we're being patient about things. We're trying to and trusting that God is leading us. Um, the back of the of the church has been completely 
um, well, it's starting to be uh, remodeled. It's not completely remodeled yet. It's starting to be uh, remodeled. They already finished two rooms, so we're working on that. And then we have to hurry up because he's moving. Um, the person that's doing the remodeling is already moving to the kitchen. So that is a little bit scary <laughs> because we have to get the carpet done to be able to move to have church um, service. So. That's a little bit stressful, but, but like I said, we're trusting God and, and everything that is going on right now. Um, what was another thing I was going to say? Um, yeah, oh, uh, trees were removed from the property simply because they were too close to the building. If, and if anything, like any type of storm, I, we thought they would probably collapse on top of the church building. So those were removed. And it's looking great. Um, so that's the update on the church. I will try actually to record some uh, in a couple of days. Um, so you guys can see the outside. So you guys can see the back of the, of the, how the back of the church is looking. And I'll probably share some pictures later on this vlog. It's just, um, you know, just talking about the update. But I, I will be more than happy to show you guys that. Um, well, if you're new to our channel and if you don't know this, my husband and I were in the ministry. My husband is a pastor or our family is in the ministry. My husband is a pastor and we've been pastoring this church for five years, but we've been in the ministry for 10 years. So, um, this is the third church that we, uh, that we've been, um, in the ministry. Yes. Pastoring. Um, we also have two children, Asher and Abby. Asher is 14, soon to be 15 in December. And then we have Abby who is 10. Her birthday is not until uh, March, so. Um, we also have our fur baby that you guys saw recently. He, um, that's Copper, and we've had him since he was two. I think he is, he's seven, right, Abby? Yes, he's seven. Yes, he's seven. Yeah, he's seven. He's seven years old. So we had him for five years too. Um, so, um, yeah, so we like to share things about our um, ministry, our everyday life, and we like to share things in DIY projects and just everything that we do. Not everything, but some of the things that we do. Um, so if you like any of that content, make sure that you subscribe uh, and make sure that you share our vlog to your family and friends. And hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here tonight. I hope you guys have a great day. Like I said, don't forget to subscribe. Give the, the video a thumbs up. And comment below any ideas that you guys can give me for the fall festival. I would be very appreciative for all of your help. We'll see you guys in the next video. And I hope you guys have a great beginning of the week. Bye-bye.